Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am reviewing and styling this wig from Youth Beauty Hair. So the first things first, I honestly need to... I've got like a low hairline, so I try to gel my hairline back all the way back as possible. I'm trying now to like um lay my hair flat. So I'm using this um, wig cap, which I later took off because it just did not work. So what I'm doing is just hurrying up and... Um, drying off the gel okay I didn't use any glue or anything so this is the wig look at the wig guys look at that wig it is beautiful I'm just showing you in the hairline I didn't really pluck that much of the hairline I plucked like do you know what? I'm lazy when it comes to wigs I'm not gonna lie guys so I honestly didn't even pluck the hairline I <laughs> if you want to call it plucking then call it plucking but I honestly plucked like twice and that was it to be honest with you so now as you can see I'm putting on powder and this did not work out at all like I put the wig back on and it just was not working out at all I said to myself I'm going to try and try new techniques when it comes to my wigs because I'm not going to try and be lazy I ended up being lazy guys because I want I wanted to glue this on at first but it just did not work out as you can see the wig cap was showing <laughs> it was showing like no one's business so I was like nah forget this I didn't even want to glue it on so this is like a glueless wig tutorial because I ended up not even using gel I just used mousse and it, the wig was good to go so you'll see it there that's the hairline on my head anyways it's so natural guys so what I'm using is elastic band I haven't used elastic band in years so what I did is I literally just um sewn sew it is that the word sewn it on ear to ear that sounds weird when I say that <laughs> oh, I placed it on ear to ear and as you can see now the wig is laying flat and tight on my head um I will be came wearing my um my afro down soon I'm going to the hairdressers because this can't run anymore guys I've got hair tutorials to do and the way that these leg these um wigs are on my head is just not a it's not a must it's like it's not cute guys okay I know alright but as I said before I don't want no one cane rowing my hair down or corn rowing my hair guys I know you're gonna come for my neck it's cane row corn row tomato tomato like yeah anyways <laughs> oh, so this is the mousse I am using I am literally just using mousse as you can see and it is laying down flat so what I do is like I put I try to like place down baby hairs like a really thick and then what I do is like I move them after when it's dried but I just need something to help me secure the front down so I can't explain it any more than I'm showing you guys <laughs> so yeah Okay, so makeup is done. I take my headscarf off after like half an hour. Um, and yeah, that's it really. I'm now going to try and cut some, not even cut some layers actually. I just try and cut that piece off. That is at least cutting I did. <laughs> As you can see, I am a bit lazy when it comes to wigs these days. Um, so yeah, I am now putting um, powder onto the hairline and stuff like that. Um, these baby hairs are quite like they're kind of like a fail let me not lie but guys I needed some baby hairs to help me secure down this wig I was not about to glue it down I well gel it down I really can't be bothered with all of that nonsense I really can't be bothered so now I'm using some water just to flatten it down just a tiny bit because when it comes to curly hair like I said before I like to see like thickness I like to see um, some definition but I don't like it too wet so yeah this is it here really yeah, so considering it's not glued down, I think I did a pretty good job. The only thing I don't like is these baby hairs that I've done at the front. Well, I don't know what they are. I just thought, let me mould, because I was using the mould, and I've seen some other like people mould the baby hairs and stuff, but I didn't even really cut the baby hairs. I kind of just, just moulded it like that. But um, that's something I can work on and stuff like that. Sorry, but I was on a time scale today, guys. I had to quickly hurry up and make like do this video before um, Amaya wakes up. So yeah, when it comes to curly hair, I kind of like it defined but big at the same time. Do you know the ones? I don't like it too wet because it just makes it go like that. This is surprisingly a really nice wig. Like I thought it was gonna come like thin. Um, very thick at the front and stuff like that, but it's actually really really nice um, What I did is how to um, keep them down is I just use mousse and I flattened it on my head and That's it as long as I don't really lift it up. It's really it's really basically good to go. So yeah, 
this is how the wig came look at look what the wig came in this i thought this was so cute it's like a little mini like you know those clothes hanging things that you like keep like suits safe or dresses safe youth beauty on there so that's where the hair comes from so yeah guys that's it thanks for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye